I need you guys to be aware of what you're transmitting. And if it if it's something like let's say you you're telling a joke to your buddies in the same vehicle as you. Well, you don't need to transmit that over the radio to everybody who's operating in the area. Because that just clogs up the radio, and if somebody needs to get some information out there, well, they can't because, you know, talking over them. So anything you want to say, I need you guys to be mindful of what you're saying and where you're saying it. Um, keep things mission-related on the radio. Uh, use proper terminology so when you finish speaking uh, and you're expecting a response, say over. When you finish speaking and there is no response required, say out. Uh, if you have to pause in the middle of a sentence, say break. At that moment, nobody can talk on the radio until you finish your transmission. Uh, if it, let's say you're giving a transmission and you fumbled on your words and you can't remember what you were supposed to say, don't start stammering on the radio, don't start swearing and yelling because that just clogs up the frequency. Just chill, breathe, say break, and then stop transmitting for like a minute or two while you figure out what you want to say. Then retransmit, then over or out, depending on what you want to say. What if we're in a combat situation that minute could get us killed by not being able to transmit anything? What That's a circumstance where you'd say what the fuck you need to say. It, it, like, I mean, I, all shit hits the fan when we're getting shot at. So at that point, I, I'm more lenient on getting your words out there. Whether or not they're clean and, and nicely polished, it doesn't really matter. Because right. as, long, as long as you're getting the information out there is what's most important. But when we're not taking shots, just keep things tight. I, I don't know if I sounded harsh there, but I just that, that needs to be said. We're not taking shots, so if anyone's drinking... Better not be. Ah, there we go. Mixing pain meds and alcohol. Perfect. Fuck yeah. <laughs> I'm actually joking. I believe you. Alright, uh... So is Best getting on, or is he not? I don't know how to message him, I don't know what's going on. I don't uh, see him, I, I can don't try see to get him. a hold of it real quick. He would have helped even out the team. Yeah, he's not on mine on Steam. I'll quickly get to Discord and see if I can get a hold of him. Oh my goodness, why, why am I getting such bad frames right now? Yeah, what I'm getting it? 20 FPS. And 30, and I normally have 60. <laughs> At best, it's completely gone dark. I'll send him an offline message, but I don't know if it's going to get to him. What the fuck? I'm messaging Squeaks on Discord. See if, you want, see if he's getting on. Well, here's an idea. If they do get on, we're, we should already be starting the op. Because we don't want to always be waiting for everyone. If yeah. you're on late, too bad, it'll just teleport true. you into the middle of the I mean, of the we're already making good time because it's only 10 minutes after the, stop, the start of the op time and we're already ready. At this point, right, we're just waiting um, for people, so we're already making good time. I'm uh, trying to fix some of the frames issues you guys are having right now. But Best has gone dark, Squeaks isn't answering me, so... Connor, I guess we're ready when you are. Yeah, give me a sec, I'm just gonna try and fix some of the frame rate issues. Uh, did you guys all read the op word? I read it. Well, peacekeeping right. mission shouldn't expect much contacts. So there are going to be insurgents. Just be careful. Yeah. yeah, don't be surprised. But there's no mounted guns on the Humvees. Uh, Connor, uh, do you need me to tell you who's in what team? Um. Uh, yes. Okay. Go for it. I'll type it to you so you can look at it. Okay. Still getting those microphone issues. Yeah, I'm gonna fix it right now. Alright. Hopefully, I don't want to. Because I got tabbed out, so hopefully, it doesn't break anything. Oh shit, it's the fan right after that. <laughs> how, long has he, how long have you had the headset for? Um. A month? Okay, so that can't be it. Just be what is what's here. what model and what brand is of headphones? It, it it's uh, a razor, razor crack, crack and whatever. Oh, I can hear myself. Okay, now I can't. Did you guys hear that too? Yes. Yep. Okay, that was weird. He's probably doing some kind of diagnostic on it that's provided by the drivers of the headsets. I don't think Connor is that technically savvy. No, it does, it's like, you just press a button and it does all that stuff. 
So Wild Fragger is on blue team or red team? No, Fragger is red team. Okay. Caboose. Okay, so red team is comprised of Caboose, Patterson, Fragger, and Howard. Blue team is Chief, Jenkins, and Hammer. So wait, Fragger's new? Yes. That's Fragger's new. He's supposed to change his name to Scotty, but... I, yeah, sorry. It's not that important for the first one. Well, go on the self-interaction and change... Do, go to team management and change yourself to red. Did I fix it? Is it good? Uh, no. No, because you know you have no you task force stuff going on. The TFR is not engaged. That's probably because my game crashed. Oh. Cool. God damn it. <laughs> Tad out just fine, and my game does not crash. Yeah, but your computer is much better than Connor's. Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't spend three thousand dollars on it, so yeah. All right. Well, you guys, we have to wait a bit because I gotta get back in here. It's okay, Connor. We're used to it. Yeah. I mean, we're still making really good time. Yeah. So. No, it's it's still only been like fifteen minutes. At normally, we'd still be putting our boots on at this point. So, we're making decent time. Don't psych also, it. Chief, Chief, I really like the picture of that. I haven't actually seen the inside of a server uh, rig yet, and that looks awesome. It's amazing. Just a mess of wiring. <laughs> no, actually, it's actually pretty clean. Is that two CPUs that it's using? Two Xeons. Dude. But they're slow as crap, but so, they have a lot of cores. Uh, Howard, are you Ooh. streaming this? Uh, I'm in, I'm on a Scotty, may I borrow you? Because, like, I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, like, Come hither. this must be the most riveting content. Riveting content. Oh, you know what? This is a good time to set up mine, actually. I mean, it's kind of like how armor is until we actually make infantry contact. Calm before the storm. Stop making Life is Strange references! That's oh, that's right. That, that was a game, game, I forgot. I watched the movie, I wasn't really impressed. I didn't know Steam had movies like that. Connor's that went over everybody's here. head. <laughs> and it's gone. Since when was Net Netflix integrated into now Steam? Be So we just take we're taking two standard Humvees without any MGs or grenade launchers. Don't need them. We're just going on a peacekeeping mission. Okay, I'm back. Like we're just going to like talk to people, you know, get some intel. We're not looking for a fight here. You know, that you, does... you, you have your rifle. That brings up a question I had. We're soldiers that are armed, walking up to a civilian. We should probably be tactful about how we approach questioning them. Otherwise, they'll think that we're trying to terrorize them. Because we got to remember what kind of situations they've been in in this country. Yeah. Have Grimace going to it. <laughs> God damn it, Chief. So maybe we should, like, have a certain way of talking. Like, one person who's going to be talking to them. That can... Talk to them like they're tourists in an American town. Just be very rude, be very loud, and speak very slowly as if their IQ is 20,000 <sighs> points lower than yours. Gosh. We will give you, you Pizza Hut New York if you participate. Yes. Yeah. We'll give you free coupons to Pizza Hut if you tell us what's going on. <laughs> I don't think I don't think the people in Duala have a Pizza Hut. Then go Hall Pizza Hut. I don't know how to say it. That that sounds mighty racist to me, Chief. What? We'll just give him some rice. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Welcome to the rice fields. <laughs> Welcome to the rice fields, motherfuckers. Oh, and I'd nominate Patterson for, uh, verbal relations with the civilian population, then. Yeah, I think I'm the only one who can be trusted here. Yeah. This is the, this is the guy with, who has the most amount of anger issues. I just feel that the way that we Excuse talk... you. <laughs> I just feel that the way we communicate with civilians has to be careful, because we're military, that scares them. <laughs> I'm, I'm not really scared if a military man walks up to me. I'm scared if they bust into my house. Inside. Yes, but you don't live on Isil Dawala. You also don't live in a war zone, although that could be debated. 
Well, uh, got much. some hot politics going on here with Trump and Putin. And we're not going to talk about nope, it. Nope, nope, no. It we're backing it up. We're running it back. Not touching that. <laughs> it's what an echo chamber doing? conversation. Nope. Shut up. I don't think about. that's going on podcast either. <laughs> nope. The last thing Patterson wants to talk about is just what the fuck's been going on with politics. He would rather hear a bunch of people complain about the Assassin's Creed series being bad than that. Because at least that is an opinion, and it doesn't involve, like, it doesn't involve major backlash that would yeah. ruin friendships. That's just an oh, opinion yeah. on a game, which is supposed to be an opinionated matter, which is supposed to have, you know, open for interpretation. And I don't want to talk about anything other than just art. <laughs> It wouldn't have been one hell of a podcast, though. Oh yeah, no, but like that's that's like that, that's I'm saving that for the last episode when I go off the grid before I can be fucking harassed for saying things. So let's talk about the NSA. <laughs> the podcast never has another episode again. <laughs> I mean, according to the NSA, we've already made that episode. Oh okay. You have? When was that? Madison already has three it, it's strikes. A jo- it's a joke about the NSA always listening in. So to them, we've already made the episode because they've already heard us talk about it. They got data on every grain of salt on the earth. I believe it. Who's in the arsenal? Where the oh, fuck did the shriding go? He's just running around. Uh, he had to borrow Fragger for a second. Yeah, they're back. So what'd you guys talk about? Something that we missed uh, yesterday. Oh, and oh yeah, we he had to go. Preaching. That's right. So we did that. Cool. Alright, we should be, uh. Right. We should be getting out there as soon as Connor's done. Uh. Get the man nuggies. Okay, you know what? That had me one of the more racist videos, you know, the welcome to the rice field, motherfucker, dude. <laughs> Well, the thing is, Cody Frank's channel is based off of shock value. Scotty, is your uh, radio good? Yes. Any reason yeah. you're pointing your rifle at him? <laughs> yeah. No, he doesn't really know about the double tap control thing. <laughs> oh, no, we just did it. <laughs> Debugged. Uh, radio check on frequency 100. Loud and clear. I won't say it. Okay. Yeah, only one, only one person supposed to say it. Yeah. I just don't like the Lima Charlie thing. We just did too much, and it's like, eh. no, hey, but Patty. yeah. What if uh, Scotty here did a uh, like automatic rifleman? Cause Howard's a rifleman. Uh, Chief has the C9. What about Grenadier? Okay. I mean, he's why a... do we need a Grenadier? This is a peace peacekeeping mission. <laughs> Fair enough. You gotta give him a squad. Well, why a boom suit? Why do you have an AT4 then? Yeah. Alright, uh, do this I even have a Grenadier kit? Rifleman kit? No, we just I have either. it to make ourselves look cooler. I do have a Grenadier kit. He has oh, the kit. Oh. All of them. Okay. Well, then he you have the Grenadier kit. Go get the Grenadier kit, right, uh, Scotty. Oh, uh, we got him everything yesterday. <laughs> and then make sure you get the radio bag, the, the 152. Damn, looking at this gun reminds me of the M16 without the clip loaded in. What? what he the said fuck clip. did you say? Uh, I, I meant the, uh, the, the book reading material version of, uh, of a uh, paper holder. I'll kill you. I, I hate you. I bet <laughs> Hammer refers to magazines as paper weights. Clip zines. Well, I was gonna say reading material. I don't like you people. Then, Mike, anyone to begin to uh, source Chief, no, You're not no. entirely wrong. Chief, I'm gonna have a migraine. Oh, Chief, gosh. Get him off your head. You, oh, you get off, no. You get off his don't eat. No. <laughs> Sit down and be patient. And we are back to stand there off. And he is time. doing the duck walk. Yep. Connor, mm. are, we, are we ready to go? Yeah, yeah we you. should be ready. Alright, then I want to stand up. Sorry, do you know how to use that thing? I just set down. Uh, oh, you're in for a ride. 
Wait, you haven't trained him on... Gr oh, no. I Why did I agree to it then? It's always a first time for something. Alright, so if you hit F to change your fire rate, if you hit it twice, you, you'll switch to your grenade. Okay, and, sure. <laughs> and it should be pretty So simple. if you raise your weapon, you'll see the flip sight come up on the side, and that's a good indication that you have um, the M203 selected. Spooky. Uh, are you, we're being teleported there. Everyone else is going to join us shortly, though. Okay. One by one, hurrah. hurrah. I actually hurrah. wonder, though, with the kills mod, can't you just do a group teleport? Oh, yeah, wait. you could have done that. Wait, I know what he's yeah. doing. He wants to do it by fire team, and it's just too close. He could teleport other people unintentionally. I see now. That makes sense. Why the heck are we all the way over here? Uh, I'm sure there's a reason for it. Let's just wait patiently. We don't have Fragger this time. We do not. Uh, and he's part of Red Team. Wait a minute. One, two, three, four. Okay, yeah, I see. Caboose is still not flagged up as, uh. I don't really care what's up with him, but. What's the point of Team Colors if not everybody follows him? Because we set the example then. And he's a part of their team. Should I spy on him right now? This is our color. This is our team, Hammer. Wait, how are we supposed to contact them? They're all the way across the map. Well, we're not talking to them, then. We'll just talk to the house instead. We don't have long-range comms unless we have a, a Humvee set. And even then, they don't have an LR either. Let's, let's pull off Morse code with a fire alarm. Well, my friends, I'm going to read you the op board regardless of you, if you've read it or not. If I redo it... Here's what's going on. This is going to be a simple peacekeeping up. Uh, just look around, but we're not look, we're not looking for contact. We're going to get two unarmed Humvees. We shouldn't need support. Uh, rules of engagement, you know these. Do not fire unless fire upon. Uh, but specifics are left up to our overlord, Patty. Command and the summary, the story part of this is commands been writing us to get out on our goodwill goodwill missions and get the people back on our sides. Get out there and talk to the locals, see what they need from us, and get them the help they need. Keep it tight and don't lose your shit, as Patterson would say. All right, sounds easy enough. Sounds, sounds good enough to me. Probably should have magazines loaded into the guns then. First time I heard you say that. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, are, are they off-road magazines? Well, okay. I need some kind of reading material, so I gotta put it somewhere. And fit it in the backpack, because that's where I have all the life-saving stuff. Do you have defibs, by any chance? I believe I have an AD, yeah. Okay. Let me look here. Well, uh, let's uh, yeah, do. kind of figure out our capabilities. Uh, actually, sure. there's something I gotta tell you guys really quick. There's been a change to the uh, entrenching tool. You can dig the small and big ones as normal, but you can also do short, giant, and vehicle trenches. Take a look at this real quick. Uh, yeah, I've seen it already, but um, they take uh, a more exponential amount of time just to make them. Oh, yeah. Oh, chief. But what about the short trench? Shouldn't that take less time? I feel like it would. Yeah, short trenches are actually pretty quick. Chief? Yeah. Oh, wow, that was... Yeah. Was that the short one? No. Oh, it's still in the loading bar. No. I'm still... Lo it's still... I'm digging. It's actually... I like the formation on it. So the small and big ones look like basic ghetto, but this one's like a trench trench. Mm-hmm. This could be handy if we actually, actually had the time in field. You know it would be nice if we could actually contribute to the trench and yeah. enhance Let's the speed. Base interaction, maybe? I wish. Yeah, there's nothing. Oh, uh, yeah. That does so, stink. Let's analyze our, ca our uh, medical capabilities. I have uh, 26 packing bandages, uh, 5 morphine auto-injectors, and 3 tourniquets to cover those limbs. So maybe like three eye facts? Uh, I don't know. What? Well, 
isn't the normal eye pack just got like one morphine or something? It should. The, bandage? Okay. the person wouldn't even have the morphine, realistically speaking. I kind of splurged on medical supplies because I forgot to change that particular load. That's the three using the old one. I got three PAKs. Uh, I've got ten elastic bandage, twenty saline bags, five hundred ml, uh, twenty morphine, twenty epi. And I think that's it for medical capabilities, including the AED and some tourniquets. I bought some cable ties in case we do end up getting some type of contact, because I prefer we not kill people. I have a diffusal kit just in case, and a mine detector. This stuff was left in my loadout that I didn't check before I actually got out here, so... Billy, I'm probably not going to need okay. this, but... I'm not about to drop military equipment here out in the middle uh, of the hammer? This is good. Now, I, if you were to go halfway, it would be kind of this height. Where is I'm, this a vehicle trench? Yeah. Don't forget, you can shift stances by holding control and using the... Uh, yeah, but so. that, that still isn't high enough. Well, it for is this for one. me. Not for me. But the thing is, when... You, I, if you go about halfway or three fourths of the way built, you can um, do crouch and. You expect yeah. to be teleported back. Wait, uh, what? Potentially. We're gonna be teleported back. I expect it, but I'm not sure if it will happen. I'm gonna really quickly use the restroom. Just cover for me. It'll only be like a minute. <laughs> How do we cover him if we get teleported? I'm gonna make myself a fortress of solitude. Better shoot your fortress of solitude. I just wanted to prove a point. Uh, hey guys. Hey. We've been given a task. Alright. Move to the town, there's a vehicle near the church. Okay, Which we're town? moving. Okay, uh, so. To the east. The town church. of Carousel? Yes. Alright. Yeah, yeah, right about okay. right here. We can Come on, Chief. Yeah. Yep, we're heading out, Chief. Yay! Road trip. We're not expecting context, so we'll play it like that. Uh get staggered on the roadway. Uh Okay, I'll Chief head left, I'll be right side, and then I'll be staggered or <sighs> How do you like my private jet? It's so pretty pretty. This is fun. Red, this is blue. Radio check on frequency one zero zero. If you are out there, over. Blue team, please enter combat pace as I've seen you already do. Over. Turn off stamina. Yeah. Okay, I was gonna say, I don't see my stamina bar, but my guy's still breathing heavily. Because digging a trench causes you to technically lose stamina now, so you're gonna be constantly breathing heavy now. Because it's confused. I'm confused.
Three, two, three, zero, nine, seven. Contact in the town northeast. We took shots. Lost visual of the guy. Chief, hammer, hook right and head for the crest of the hill. Uh, up ahead to the east. You, you see that over there? Over. Get eyes on the town. Yep. I'm going to be watching the road in the town proper. Over. I think there's contact at the top of the church tower. Over. Well, that was unexpected. I just took a hit. Hey, I've noticed that you've identified contact. Uh, please, if, uh, AR, can we start laying down fire on the chapel position? Uh, there is confirmed contacts there. Over. I need covering fire and route to your position. Over. Start putting down rounds down range. Is anybody on this channel? Yes, I'm going to do that right now. The entrance is down. I think he might be just in shock right now. Chief, maintain uh, base of fire from your position. You see it with the weapon, you shoot it. Uh, just fire. Over. Confirming contact at the chapel, by the way. Over. visual on you. I have identified contacts within the chapel. Please make way to my position. Over. I am fragging that position. There are two guys on the other side of the wall. Over. behind you. On the other side of the Vic, on the other side of this wall, by the entrance of the chapel, there is one armed with one AK. Over. Repeat, last over. Chapel, outskirts are clear.
Sweat on shackle. Hammer secure the exterior of the chapel. Uh, head around it. Make sure there's nobody else. Chief, you're coming in with me. All right. So, breach. Yep, clear over here. Exterior clear. Over. Free wheels. Alright. Right, we've acquired a vehicle. However, we must figure out the location of our friendly forces. Uh, we are kind of alone in this whole AO. Just keep that in mind. Uh, so, from this point on, we're probably going to have to try to link that back up with them. I guarantee you, if we found hostilities here with militia, we're going to find more. I oh. know you're right here too, but just so anybody's listening in. Okay, so this is our only mode of transportation at this time. Looks like we got an M2 in the Land Rover. We actually got an RPG as well, but... Do you really see us using that? No. no. Maybe the MG, but not anything else. So, in knowing that there's already militia activity, uh, and they're using AKs and have this whole setup here, they even have a radio tower up top, if you look on top of that chapel. They're so advanced. I'm not, oppo I'm not objecting to the idea that they may be utilizing IEDs. Unless Connor doesn't know how to place IEDs. But, um, it's time to start making our way and trying to link up back with friendly forces. We're looking back at a uh, escape from Stratus situation. Feel? Okay. Yep. Let's load up. Chief, get on the gun. Hammer, just get, get inside. I'm driving. Let me see if, the, if there's a radio in this thing. There is no radio in this thing. Okay. Even if there was a radio, it probably wouldn't work for our stuff. Civvy's to our left. What's up with those guys? Oh no! <laughs> Don't shoot. <laughs> If they start hugging the vehicle, uh, fire off warning shots. Otherwise, this is getting sketchy. They're like ducklings. What the heck is going on here? They're just trying to avoid fire. Oh, we're not cooking marshmallows, so they shouldn't have any issues. We're gonna avoid. Remember, these are real people with real lives. So you're capable of shooting from that position? Uh, that is 10-4. I just didn't want to have my gun out and scare the civvies. Real quick, gotta check something. Which building? Anything. It looks like they're already on their way to us, our friendlies. My eye on the southeast sector right We're gonna now. link back up. Uh, we're gonna start moving southeast.
fucking did go up ahead. I wonder if there's a long-range radio on that one. It's a civilian vehicle. Yeah, you want... I don't think it would. Copy. Like, this one doesn't even have one. Then again, makes sense. I heard static. Looks like they're kicking indoors wherever they see. Okay. Check out this little villa up here. Looks pretty clean to me. I haven't seen anybody. Basically doing patrol ops right now. By the way, Chief, how are your wounds? Chief? Oh, yeah, I thought my mic was unmuted for a second. Um, I stopped my bleeding. He's in the open field. Uh, hammer, disembark. Stay on the back of this rock. I'm pulling the vehicle up to get the gun up. Uh, they're turned directly 076 over this hill. Armed. Three men. Over this hill, 076, on the rock. So we're all clear. Chief, Chief, how, how are you right now? I'm not hit. We have a positive copy. We are currently in combat engagement on Grid 034092. Over. We're piling the Vic. We're going to get in a more secure position. Understood. I'm in. We're getting I don't engaged see him. Ah, it's okay. Chief, sit. Chief, sit. Alright, I'll fix them up. Don't stop. I'm not bleeding. I'm fine. I'm not bleeding. So it looks like there was MLA fighters back there. Uh, we're gonna keep trying to link up friendly forces. Alright. Alright, I'll get a broadcast traffic. Alright team, this is Blue Team. Be advised, we are going to attempt to link up with you. We just finished with a combat engagement. Tell copy, over. Engaged in open grounds and behind us, so I'm not object. I'm not opposed to believing that they're going to be in this town too. That's the price we got to pay to get to our friendlies. Expect ambushes from the trees up ahead. And he's capable of an ambush. Then we're going to clear the enemies that they're facing from behind. Because the shots you're hearing is uh, MLA fighters. I hate when these uh, loading distance bushes happen. They look like people. Hammer. Yes. 
think you can use the RPG that's in the back? It's a single dummy fire. Yeah. Okay, because we're gonna when we get down there, I'm gonna do a soft dismount, and you're gonna hit what's ever down there, because we're expecting contact right over this uh, hill. Uh, Roger that. Can you give me a rough direction when we get there, back? You're gonna see it's directly like two zero eight. If you see guys on the northwest side of the bridge, don't expect them to be ours. You want me to hit them with an RPG? I mean, I'm not objecting to it. I believe I got visual. Uh, roger that. Oh, yeah. lay down fire? I'm trying to get these C7s and see if it's fine. I'm trying to get eyes on. Oh, I was on bushes. Do you see any? I was looking at bushes. Um, It'd be more close to the... Uh, Blue team, this is red team, what's your location? Uh, red team, this is blue team, we are currently across the bridge, we are just around that little bend down the road once you cross the bridge, over. Copy that, are you in a technical, over? Yes. Blue team copies that, we are in a technical, over. Understood, uh, your advance, the bridge looks clear, we've cleared the bridge of enemy contacts, uh, we are on the other side the of the house. river, over. Uh, we copy that. Uh, we'll, we'll be engaged. Contact by white. Contact by the white structure. Over. Towards your northwest. Whoa. And towards your northwest. Northwest. I think he's talking about yeah. northwest. We're 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 gunning it. There's one down there. Where? Well, no, never mind. I can use the building uh, on the. Side of the bridge. Oh, you. Did you copy that trident? What? Could you please repeat last over? Red team is taking up a position of build building uh, south of your current position. Blue team copies that out. The fuckers. Hey! Don't use building, don't, don't kill us. Alright. Alright, we're gonna get out of here. Get some fresh mags in. Open the door. Everyone's up on top of the building. I'm going to pot us and go on to the roof. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like it wouldn't be more sense to have Caboose up here, not me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, better repack some magazines. Alright, check yourselves, pack yourselves up if you need to, repack mags if you need to. This is our holding position for now. Once you guys are ready, we're going to get moving. Hey, did command give us a specific destination, Patty? Uh, we have to make it back to Nubia, I believe. Negative, there's an FOB right at the border. Oh, yeah, I see it. Nubia. Grid is 043039. So we have to avoid it and get back to Nubia? No, no, that's a friendly FOB. We have to make it, we have to make it there. There is an enemy FOB, uh, 053061. Huh. So in between us and the friendly fob, there is an enemy fob, which is just west of the and airport. And the capital of the fucking m and territory, fucking Bullabunga. Yeah, that too. So I'm thinking we 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 uh, head west from Bullabunga and the enemy fob. We just avoid that entire section altogether. Take the western approach and then head south uh, to the friendly fob. That makes sense to you guys? Sounds easy enough. I'm sorry, could you do it one more time and I'm gonna draw out a line? Yeah, alright. So, in between us and the friendly fob, which is just at the river, uh, there is an enemy fob which is west of the uh, airport at the center of the island, and it's also right next to Bolabongo, which is the capital of... Uh, That's the why we're lagging out. So, my plan that I'm proposing here is take the western approach all the way around the fucking town and make our way south to the uh, fob. That way we're completely avoiding the fob and the possibility of having the entire capital to hunt us down. So, going this way, like the line I'm drawing right now, and we are going around it, and where are we going from here? Uh, keep heading south. All the way to uh, Hill marked 88. And then probably, uh, we could cross, yeah, we could cross the bridge there and make our way south. I'm, I'm thinking that's a more, that's a safer position. I 
it's going to be a real highway to fucking hell. Yeah. Um, alternatively, instead of uh, taking the road, which is just, which is like just west of the town, we could um, like stay even west of that uh, secondary airport. Like where? Like, give me a little mouse pointer here. Yeah, hang on. Uh, so at your intersection here, do you want to point that? Uh, no, I don't. Okay, so go northwest of the. T okay, look at our position. Right, I see a position. You, you see me pointing? No, I don't. Are you holding the left mouse button? Yeah. Uh, I tried right, moving it. Yeah, I've completely lost your pointer. I don't know why. All right, what, whatever. What chat are you in? I'm going to draw a line, and a, and you're going to see it. Can you draw it in green? That way you can show it as an alternative path. All right. Uh. All right, three, six, deuce. On. Okay, so... We can go that way and then basically go down the rest of the way of the road and... Okay. It's just this way we're avoiding the town entirely, although we are going next to the airport. Alright, what does everybody think? I think I like the green path idea. Green path seems... Yeah. I don't All like right. the concept of going through a town, All right, though. I'm coming down. Alright, so green path? I think green path. Alright, the green path it is. Let's Red go. pill! I the concept of going through a town, but sure. We're not going through a town. The entire point is that we're avoiding it. The green path looks like it goes through a town. Oh, well, I mean... Okay, I see what you mean. Fair enough. Um, it, it looks like a small enough village for it not to matter. If it's really that big of a deal, then we can probably find an in-between uh, from Hammer's original line and the newly drawn green line, which passes in between the airport and the town. Uh, alternatively, we could split from the airport and head straight to the mountains. But I think that's a situation where we'll burn that bridge when we get to it. Over. Navigator, hammer. Oh, great. Okay, um... Um, can I fire off so, these last tall shots so I can have this mag reloaded? No. Hey, Rogative, who is the lead vet? Over. Stay by. Think <laughs> right. So we're gonna be going off road. I'm trusting you. All right. You know how right. that's the reason. We'll be we'll taking up lead. I'm gonna trust you. Let them overtake us and then go on to the MSR. You turn now. Sorry, so yeah, it's been, I was trying to back up. Past I'm gonna wait for them to overtake. Gonna, like, like five, oh, so Brett seems to be okay. Yes. Patterson. I'm playing in first person for the first time now. I have to play this on free look though. I just like it better. For this situation. <laughs> so I can look around and drive. East Tokyo Drift. Uh, I can't with this thing. Hold on, X. Just to clarify, we are taking blue line. Okay. Do you see anything pop up in red on the map? Which I'm sure you will eventually do mark it. Or call it. We're gonna be off road again. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the map. I am expecting to see 
like blimps eventually. Blimps? Mm -hmm. Flying ovals. No. I didn't see a rock. Red team, this is blue team. Be advised, our Humvee hit a rock and we are overturned. Over. Copy that. Red team is, uh, turned around for you. That's fucking stupid. Uh, is this interaction if anything for flipping vehicles? Nope. Yeah, what well, if it was Halo Hammer where I could just, like, press flip? <laughs> press E to flip. Flip. That's stupid. I need Red my girl. Strength. I trusted you. I didn't see the rock because I was playing <laughs> first person. Fair enough. I didn't see what happened, so I don't know what he hit. Yeah, because you were aiming up. Alright, they're coming in from the south. Coming from the southwest. I, yeah. At least for one big happy hop in case. That's freaking hot end. <laughs> I hope so. It should be able to. It should be able to ride in the back. Yeah, these uh, Op 4 techies are usually con cars. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't look like it's got nope. any slots for us. Why don't we try ramming their vehicle back over? Yeah, why don't you do that? Alright, right, make here. way, let them back up. Wait, do we have like advanced towing? I first and while driving and didn't see the ride. No, we don't have advanced towing. Want me to get out? Whoa. This is so dangerous. I'm expecting this thing to explode. I don't think it'll do that as long as they do it slow and steady. Oh my. Almost says it's. Uh, did you guys see that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. You might have to ram it. Oh, what oh, the oh. fuck? Oh. Oh, fucking hell, dude. We got really close. Hang on. Three sixty, everyone. Yeah, don't watch me. Set up security. Make sure we don't get snuck up on. Good call, Howard. Oh, he did. I, he... I got it. Good. Let's mount up and get the hell out of here. Thanks for the assist, Patterson. Over. It's one here for him. Yeah. you want to drive? Sure. Um, I'll drive. They don't have to know. They don't have to know. Alright, thanks for asking, Mike. That rock, though. I love how I can go over it and nothing happens. I flipped when I hit it. No, it's just because the dust that's picking up from the duck tires. You say dust? I don't see dust. It's dirt. Okay. I don't see any dust clouds. Deja vu. <laughs> that might have been a lock that was popping in that I couldn't see. Some of these rocks actually pop in, and that sucks because there's no way you can see them coming if they pop in. You just come into your view, finally. Just they blend her in. <laughs> just as you're about to drive over them, and there's no going back. Bumpy. 
We're in a truck. We're not touching wire. We can just drive right through it. Watch out for the rocks, guys. Of course. You're in some water, though. Well, we gotta cross the border, right? That's not. Uh, you gotta do it legally. Oh come on, we're the we're the Canadian military. We're fine. Papers, please. Mm. Oh, but anyways, glory to our Stutska. Stutska. Anyway, so if we just hit him, then we exploded. Ah. Yeah. Wait, was this a border checkpoint before? I don't know. It might have been. It had the, the, the opening in the little shack. It's the Mounties outpost. I don't think they have Mounties here. Whatever we're at, they have the version of Mounties. Next thing you know, the fob shoots a rocket at us because they're in attack. A black. Where did. Okay. Punch it. No, we made it. No, we make it to the fob and then it doesn't even matter. First you get the money. So we kind of made the fob. Was... Cool. Was this the entire up? No. The, uh... Spoiler alert, it's not. Wait, what? Of course. Who did that? Rookie mistake. Was that one of us? Potentially. Uh, patch yourselves up if you need to. Who had the ability to throw a grenade? A passenger. Hard to smell. Yeah, go. Alright. Alright, guys, we made it out alive. But, uh,. I don't think it's over yet. It's never over. Dun dun dun. Uh, I don't know. I figured this would be an arsenal or something because I. I figured this would be an arsenal because I don't have any way to call into command that we made it. Uh. Well, somebody might connect with command or some shit. Oh, yeah, uh, I'm, I'm using just, my telepathic powers. I just got a message from. Uh, Connor, because we don't have a radio, and he says attack at coming in ETA five minutes. Let's start. Uh, let's start building some defenses, uh, just some trenches at like in the open area, scout out defense positions uh, in the towers. Get yourselves online. Wait, we're gonna get raided? Is that what's happening? We're getting raided. Hammer. Yeah, I guess uh, we're about to get hit. There's a lot of open ground here, so the more we cover with trenches, the better. We're a giant trench here. Are we trenching this place? Yep. Seems pretty thoroughly trenched. I just want to trench up the open areas, that way we're not, like, in the open. Luis will have some cover if, you know, uh, more start hitting or something like that. Just someone to cover us from the shrapnel if we can't make it to a building. And a fighting position in case they do make it inside. Now, over. 
Will I be able to recover from this state yeah, of the loss? Swamp kids, grab a saw, something more set up for defense. Is the stamina thing a glitch? Because I don't think I'm regaining stamina. Yeah. Wait, you... is there even a load of arsenal? If you were digging trenches, then uh, yeah, your stamina drain just. Well, it should come back soon. Uh, I didn't see one. I figured that that ammo box that we checked when we got in would have been an arsenal, but it's not. I'll mind connect with command, see if you can make it one. Over. Which direction are I coming from first? Mountain. I'll copy. Over. The They're most likely you can be attacking us from the north since that's where the border is. Over. Spread out a little bit, but don't get too uh, thin out. You know, we, we need to be able to support each other. Over. Yeah, Patterson, I'm going to take this uh, saw and set up on one of the towers at the main entrance. Cup that hammer, set up a position where we can get the wounded over to you uh, if, if things get too bad. Over. Uh, copy that. I'm gonna go with the vehicle trench I just dug. Break, 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 break. I got a helo coming in from the northeast. Over. It's a Huey. That is an enemy helo coming in from the northeast, bearing about 30 from my. Saws engage. Lost visual, went behind a hill. Copy that, keep eyes in that direction. Helicopter's 
that we've got infantry incoming. Keep your eyes open. Over. That could have just been a scout. Over. Copy that. All the more reason to keep your guns up. Out. from the northeast. They're in 30. They're taking a position uh, just beyond the ridge of the, the hill. Get your guns up. Get ready to engage once they push over. Over. Range is 300 meters. Position on the ridge. Get your guns up. Get ready to engage as soon as they pop over. Over. <laughs> 